Adamu Gaba, a former presidential aspirant under the All Progressive Congress APC, has been left embarrassed after conducting an online poll for the party's presidential candidate, Bola Tinumbu. It all started after Gaba launched an online poll on Twitter asking Nigerians if they would vote for the presidential candidate of the party, Bola Met Tinumbu, and his running mate, Kashim Shetima, or rather die. He wrote, if you are voting Tinubu Shetima personal a presidential ticket, say I or I rather die. Shocking. Tinubu is currently losing in the same poll. A check on the poll shows that 83% of participants said they would rather die than vote for Tinubu. Hmm. Okay. I I think uh, he will come back and say, oh, maybe it was doctored. Or oh, oh, he's trying to, I don't understand because with this one that is happening, they are the ones who conducted it. It's not a other other organization because from all the polls that have been conducted, Peter B has been winning. And they will come out and tell you, oh, forget it. The organization that uh, conducted the poll, not recognized, not credible, this and this and this and that. Thank God they are the ones doing it. And what is he going to say? And, you know, they, they might come up with other excuses that say, uh, you know what, uh, we have our people on ground. Like Article said, the majority of the people are not on social media. But you, you are on social media and you want a, a better Nigeria, but you see not encouraging people to not, not to be on social media. Why are people not being on social media? Because of uh, the level of poverty, because internet is not cheap in Nigeria. And lack of education, illiteracy and many more things no electricity and what have you and they are happy and bragging about it that forget all of you who are on social media you are just ranting that the majority of the people who are going to vote they don't understand english they don't have internet they don't have a they are not on social media so those are the people we are banking on and that is one of the reasons i believe that etinubu has been uh bragging you know feeling on top of the world Telling us that uh, they have 22 governors in APC who are ready to vote for them. They think uh, it's going to be business as usual. That uh, some people will just sit down somewhere, they'll be controlling. Oh, yeah, go and do this, go and do that. Recently, for as many who have sense, because let me put it that way, Buhari has come out to disgrace the so called governors that they are thieves. He calls them thieves. And because of that vexation, they themselves they've thrown another tantrum um, against a. Uh, Buhari that he has not done way and what have you. Is it the same governors that we know that uh, they are living larger than life? They are so rich, they are not even bothered about a uh, even minimum wage. They are not bothered about the welfare of the people, the security of the people. They are not bothered. Those are the same people who come out and be telling you there's no money. If there's no money, but go and check them. They are richer than the way they were before they came on board. So it's not going to be be a uh, business as usual. But don't forget, we will still have a few ones that will see be loyal to them those who have uh have who have a covenant with poverty and uh, mental uh, 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 slavery mentality so they will see how all those ones that would, that's why they will see be bragging and i said it even in bruno gilog's jonathan time do you think uh, everybody all the governors were with him some of them were even pretending to be with him but they never liked him because it's all about it uh, you have to be uh, loyal to your party you have to do this Nobody's going to be listening to anybody. That is just the truth. Even if we still have some people who are still loyal to them, but it's not going to be, be it's not going to be business as usual. So he conducted the poll now, poll now. So what is coming out? Because they will come out and begin to give you another excuses. Well, I have been saying it that we should not be disturbed with the fake support of Tinumbu we are seeing online. They are paid online agents the, uh, to spread across all social media so that you will think that Tinubu has supporters. That is how they have been renting and forcing people to attend their rallies and campaigns. Even his Yoruba brothers won't even vote for him. Well, it is clear that the North is deceiving Tinubu into believing that uh, they are firmly behind him. When in fact they are not, Tinubu himself is unaware that his time has passed. He is undoubtedly living in the past. The greed of these politicians often blind them. Please, there is power in spoken words. I believe that when I speak a thing, it comes to pass and it has been appealing or happening in my life. Rather say, I will not vote for Tinubu. I will not die. 
than to say i would rather die than to vote for tinubu yes we rather, i don't know the meaning of that statement because it is not really a, a good statement well constructed i will not vote for him and that does not mean that uh, you are going to lose your life because of who this is a trick of the devil now all those that said i cover that said it i cover all of you with the blood of jesus whatever you mistakenly decree with your mouth has been cancelled with the blood of jesus none of you shall die but you will live to witness the goodness of the almighty god in jesus name amen i would rather uh okay this one is saying the same thing well ha huh? also say, i would rather and redie hey <laughs> hey i will never die for tinubu apc my brother thanks uh you people should brace yourselves up to welcome tinubu as the next president of nigeria this is one of the supporters all these uh, slander and campaigns of calmness will not stop him from winning uh -uh. is adamu garuba now campaigning against your tinubu uh you are not serious ah uh, so sorry for them is adamu garuba now, now campaigning against him i love i love your race who is this person see see the way you are reasoning sorry you hear try to encourage yourself ahead of time well adamu gaba was a presidential aspirant in apc and its part knows much more than you conducted more than you that conducted it by more than you conducted it by himself your mr nobody wants to fault him 2023 election no rigging beavers have come to see another time Tinubu is even complaining about uh, the sincerity and the credibility of INEC. Check your mind and be prepared for the worst. They, they have been having problems. They are not comfortable with that. Please, just to say you will die if Tinubu wins the election next year. If you don't vote for him and other million people will vote for him, just tell us that uh, the devil should kill you if you remain in Nigeria. But the judge has promised to leave why shy away from the truth is it the town hall different from bulu bulala is that how it is going to rule 200 million people let us not be blind to see tinubu supporters kind of live in a cuckoo land that is why they are not even getting it rig the election and face the wrath of nigerian youth i will not vote for a sick man Adamu Gaba is an IC expert and a senior man in APC, conducted his own finding, saw the truth and tried to hide it, tried to hide it, Mr. Man, please leave APC, don't deceive yourself. This is not an embarrassing situation, we know now we then get social media, that is why we've been a social media president for Jagaban to get 17% of the pool, shows that he is the winning candidate. Hmm. One tongue, they are deceive now. <laughs> you don't reach like that. So all of them are no plenty for social media. That means you guys are illiterate. You are not on social media. You don't. You are not into. No wonder you don't even know what is happening in the other world. You don't even need to travel abroad to see what is happening. And that is why you feel that uh, that that Lagos is is all and all for you. You see, you say majority of them are not on social media. If you are not on social media, how do you know what is happening in the whole world? Is there anybody a responsible and civilized environment so that their people will not be on social media that means you are not on social media and that is why you are always myopic and have one kind of mindset you see them okay well, has no reputation i would rather die than vote uh, zinubu and shetima according to this person so opposition is worth nothing but to us nigeria absolutely correct adamu gaba's online post says it all this poll is yet another clear and concrete evidence that Peter Obi is going to win the forthcoming election. No amount of lies, self-denial, self-deceit by those playing the ostrich can stop Nigerians from taking back their country from the bad politicians through Peter Obi because with that sentiment, he is the best among all the candidates vying for the post of president in the forthcoming presidential election. Now on our true talk. So guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this.